he's covered as well. I reckon save the feather. Touch your fun. Love a bit of touch your fun. Okay, back racing. Swift racing leagues on tonight. With the illness, I'm on injury reserve. We got the full six in the team today, team time trial. It's my favorite event. They've got everyone they need, so no need for reserves. I'm gonna drop into one of these new Swift monthly racing events. This new series started just today. Uh, race like a champ. I think the whole piece is that two tracks from world championships. It's on the Glasgow. Rolling Highlands or something. Pretty flat, breakaway brain there, I think. Or a little bit of smack talk. We're in the pen. Some people are gonna hit it. We'll see if we can keep up with them. Get a sense it's gonna be fairly reserved. But who knows? Let's hit it. These up in the front. We've got 37 here today. I think my goal here is to not do too much work. I'm not going to have the top end that I probably should. So I hopefully can just sit in with the pack here. Save the action maybe for the climb. Hang on. Fortunately, this bout of COVID hasn't hit me too hard. I seem to be bouncing back all right. Wish I could say the same for my family. I've all been hit pretty hard. Gonna be back training now. Got a big challenge event coming up, as I've said. I'm in mean, a short timeline on that one. Did my FTP test on Sunday, that some of you might have seen. It went not too bad. Still sitting around that four watts per kilo. Still allowed in the bigger races. Technically day two of training in this block. A little bit of strength training yesterday. Devised a pretty clever way of doing strength training with pace partners in Zwift. What's this guy doing off at the front? Oh, he's COVID as well. There we go. Banks. Bring everyone back. I'm already breaking my rules here. I'm not meant to be doing the work. Haven't even started the lives. Let's just 
sort of sitting mid 3.5. It's not too bad, it's a good piece for beef. Still early days though. Look for rice here, we'll see what they do. Thumbs up all around. I'm just saying, ZRL's running team time trial tonight. It's on RGB, 26 Ks or something. Generally, not too bad in the team time trial, a bit shorter than some of the ones from last season. Still tough though. It's pushing four and a half, five watt per kilo turns. It's big. By about turn five or six, struggle to mount. I don't think we've lost anyone yet. Maybe just a couple of stragglers. Are you guys Chris Rose? He's gonna have his PR attempt. Best one minute, he reckons. Good luck, buddy. 520 watts for one minute. Let's just maybe sit in second seat. I wonder how many go with you. I reckon if maybe four or more go, we'll have to follow. A little bit of pressure on, I guess. Back seems to be coming. It's about where I get dropped off in ACAT. <laughs> It's nice being sitting on. Oh, I felt this on a day. It's going for 50 seconds. He only managed 50.8, so close. I don't reckon that's the last we see him Kenny, my number one supporter. Ran hell and shine, I get a ride on from that guy. It's kind of because Ran hell or shine, he's on Zwift. Sydney bot, I think.
but let's just sit on now. It runs back together. Nobody wants it. Now I might just save that feather for the second time on Breakaway Bray. Would be the opportunity for a decisive move if I still have legs by then. Strong front pack. Nobody's giving it up. No one's happy. Three and a half to four. It's a slight bump from the pace partners I've been doing this week. Something in chat this week with the wildlife and his common thread about how's B cat changing? He's saying that it's getting much faster. The popularity of Zwift is bringing more higher riders in that three and a half to four kilo category, and the competition's just higher. What do you think about that? My hypothesis is that I think the game's just changing a bit. I mean, yes, what he said, but I think there's a lot of heavier riders in the B, pushing more watts, which made a big sit-in race at a heavy time at the end. But I think we're getting more riders through the spectrums now who can hold those watts. We're getting more of a tactical race. Watch out here, don't want to lose these guys out front. Yeah, more of a tactical race. Let me know in the comments, do you think we'll see breaks in Cat B in the next 12 months? I say yes, let me know. See, Dom's happy sitting out there, isn't he? I might have been a reserve for ZRL as well. Sitting there with his four and a half. I don't think we need to track him out. If he wants it from here, I think he can have it, right?
Erst jetzt mal ein Gehör. Someone else. See, sometimes that all it takes is just to initiate it. Just saying, come on boys, we're gonna bring him in. I'll take the first turn and then everyone focus. Very noisy. Speed plays. I don't know. I like them because I'm lazy. I don't like having to get Shimano the right way up. But the friction and the rubbing and the noise and nothing. What do you think? Shimano or speed play? All very friendly here. Where are we sitting at now? Two and a half. Walk scoops coming up, yeah? That'll be a bit of fun. Walk screw and the bray again. I reckon. Save the feather. I mean, I guess, see what we see, right? Type two fun, I love a bit of type two fun. Here we go, fire. to lose my towel. It's not too bad. Makes it up a little bit though. A few people off the back. Might have thinned the front pack down to 20 now.
Okay, we're gonna cover it now. Right, here we go again. You're interested. Better this one. So it's pray to the finish. Oh, it's a bit of fun. Come on, guys. Be interesting to see the bigger riders, the non climbers. How soon are they going to go here? Seven and a half Ks. Short climb to the finish. You're not going to want it to finish like that. I reckon out of this course we're going to see fire. Anyone carrying some extra weight, if they can make it up that corkscrew, I'm going to hit it. I think the timing of that feather was pretty good. That first little break in the hill. If we can hit it right there, this is the maximum amount of feather for the finish. Shimano and riders out there. He was synchro shift. I'm a big fan. I don't like the cross threading, risk of drop chain. I ride synchro shift on this bike. Obviously, it's pretty easy on the Wahoo. I also run it outdoors. You give it a go? Like it? Don't like it? Let me know in the comments. Super valuable on Zwift. 
never run out of gears in that sprint. Saying to watch Kai. Who's Kai? Not that that means anything. I don't really know anybody. And what's going on with this dude? Too much caffeine, I think. It's just taking it easy here, I think. A few little rollers before we get to the business end. Five Ks left. Thanks, my COVID buddy's still here. I feel like he's gonna go off like a firecracker. Let's get into sprint mode. Cap backwards, more arrow. Dub's gone, see? He doesn't want to put it down to a sprint. Banks is on it. This is the move, I think. I want it.
So if you got three, all right, storm before the storm. He's hanging out there for a while. That attack, like I said, doesn't want to do the climb. Probably what I should have done. I really fancy myself for the climb. Oh, not quite. Waited just too long. That's good though, well in. Well in everybody. First race back. Can't be too upset with that. None of the people I thought were sleepers in the ranks. Stuffed. But better than I would be after a TTT. All right, team, that's it for me. Time to go and cool down, see how the Aero Boys went in ZRL. Looking forward to some more of these. Let's get some racing action going. Till next time, see ya.